Hello, I'm Zoe. I'm Oliver. Frank adopted me today. Hi, Frank. Good to see you. I see you have a new cat. This is Oliver, our new barn cat. I adopted him from the shelter, and the shelter recommended an exam to test him for FIV. What is FIV? FIV stands for Feline Immunodeficiency Virus, a viral disease that can weaken a cat's natural immune system. It's most commonly found in unneutered male cats, outdoor cats, and cats that fight with other cats. The shelter sent me his medical history. It shows here that he's around 16 months old, neutered, and tested negative for FIV a couple of months ago. But when they tested him, he had a bite wound on his tail. It's recommended to retest for FIV when a cat is newly acquired or when there's been potential exposure. His tail seems to have healed quite well, but I recommend we retest him for FIV to ensure he didn't contract the disease with that bite wound. FIV is usually transmitted in the saliva when an infected cat bites another cat. We can perform the test and discuss the results during this visit. That's great. The FIV test we use is an antibody test. False negative results are uncommon, but can occur if the test is performed before antibody concentrations are high enough to be detected. Most cats produce detectable antibodies within 60 days of an infection. That's why we are retesting Oliver today, despite his previous negative FIV result. Oliver tested positive for FIV. Cats with FIV are able to lead healthy lives, and with regular routine health checks, they can remain healthy for years. The best course of action is to continue his regular exams. Early recognition and treatment of illnesses are helpful in preventing secondary diseases. One of the most important ways to keep Oliver healthy and prevent transmission of FIV to other cats is to keep him indoors. I know you wanted him to be a barn cat. Can Oliver be an indoor cat and keep you company in the house? Whatever is best for Oliver sounds okay to me. Bring Oliver back in six months for a thorough physical exam and diagnostics. While blood work and urinalysis will help detect any health changes early, up-to-date vaccines are also important. During exams, we can also check his oral health regularly to ensure he has healthy teeth and gums to minimize the risk of oral infections. In the meantime, let's start him on flea, tick, and heartworm medication to prevent any parasitic infections. How does that sound? Excellent. I want to keep him healthy and feeling good. Congratulations on Oliver joining your family. We can set up his next appointment and pick out some toys so he has plenty of indoor activities. Oliver will be coming back in six months for a routine visit. Can you please schedule this appointment? Dr. Garcia is so nice. She said I have a virus, but I should be okay if I come in for regular checkups. I get to stay in the house with Frank where it's warm and cozy. He's getting me toys right now. See you soon. 